Welcome, my little peaches, back to another probably chaotic, uh, maybe hopefully buildy, hopefully not too much debt kind of vibes episode of um, our extreme vampire challenge. Why is it extreme? Well, it's the legacy challenge, so we're trying to get to 10 generations. And it's extreme because we decided to do it with vampires, which as we have learned is a bad idea because I think I've killed a lot of my vampires by accident so far. The good thing is that despite killing a bunch of them, um, I have also managed to at least produce an heir each time. So, I am actually going to go to a non-vampire to kick things off. So, just a little recap for everyone. Riku is our butler. He has lived, he has died, he has been a vampire's thrall, he has been eaten by Kalpan. There isn't much this man hasn't done, but he serves the house, so that is Riku. Music is a little loud, okay. Um, oh, it's because there's two desktop audio. I don't know why this keeps happening. There we go. Okay, that should be a little bit better. Thank you for letting me know. Um, then we've got Violet. Violet used to be a little sweetie pie, however... Um, not anymore. She's watched too much death and destruction. She watched um, one of her children leave and become human. And she watched another one uh, die. So she's kind of gone very much off the rails and is now kind of evil. And we need to figure out what to do with her. Then we've got Klaus, who I'll be aging up in today's episode. He's um, Violet's grandson. His mom has died, but his dad is blood. Am I right on the name so far? Hopefully I'm right so far. And then we've got a new character. So, Kim Kiola, distantly related to Makoa. Hopefully, I need to check her family tree. Uh, it is a Kiola. And what happened is, um, Violet killed her, but she resisted death because she is a spellcaster. That's what we're going with, that is the story. So, in the last episode, um, we added her to the family because she died as a child and then instantly came back to life again. Clearly showing that she's magic. This music is still a little bit loud, thank you. Um, and then, yeah, we decided, well, the only way she could have survived is if she's a spellcaster. She actually aged up as we added her to the household. So now she's living with us and she's currently in the magical realm. So we're going to head to the magical realm and say hello to her. And yes, this is my new loading screen. I'm actually matching my loading screen to the color of the generation that I'm on in Not So Berry, which is currently orange. So there we go. Right, can you guys, is the music volume a little bit better now? Okay, brilliant, thank you. Sorry, it's some of my audio like doubles up and I don't know why it started doing that. But instead of playing one audio track, it plays two. So it gets very loud. And, here is where we left her. So she's actually still exhausted from being bitten by Violet. We can see the scars on her. And we kind of took her into Cass. And, um, oh, you're off to go eat. I think I'm actually gonna bring her home. She's now a spellcaster, but I just wanted to show you guys that, you know, she's here. Um, oh, we're already in the magical realm. Okay, so we've got to travel back through and bring her home. I know I've just loaded, but she's, she's like, really exhausted so it's probably worth it just coming home unless should i buy some magical supplies from here before i leave because you know loading screens are pretty long i feel like it would make sense so let me get her to go for a wee then we'll get some magical supplies and then we'll head home and i am actually just gonna mess with the music one last time so that you guys can hear the in-game audio well as well so i will switch this down to 10 and then switch everything up and then you guys will be able to hear the in-game stuff a little bit better um and yeah let's go ahead actually and check on her family tree real quick so this is her oh no guys is she a kiola she's gotta be right <laughs> we were just like kiola great i'll base her on makoa but now i'm kind of where is the kiola link I can't actually see the link. <laughs> we just went by a surname and now I can't find. But what it might have done is just called everybody above this generation. I think that's probably what happened. Yeah, the game's probably deleted Makoa from the tree. Okay, I'm actually gonna cheat like up these a little bit. 
Just so that I can keep her in the magical realm for like a little bit longer. Mako I mean, Mako was definitely there because of the surname. That family is the only one with that surname. Um, so yeah, it's fine. It makes total sense. And I will send her to Diagonally. This is definitely Diagonally. To get, I want to buy like a magical wand and a broom maybe. I think that would be a good show. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Game just crashed. We'll try this again. My whole game just crashed. Well, good start. Good start. Uh, Annie, thank you so much for the four months. Happy four months. I love Alice and her story. Happy Pride Month to all the wonderful, amazing peaches. I'm so glad to be in such a great community. Love you, Claire. Please give Bean a hug. She's not with me. She's too hot in this room, but I will give her a hug. Luckily, we hadn't done loads of stuff before it crashed, so that's good. Um, and Saz, thank you so much for the bids. Speaking of Starsguard, Scarsguard. Oh my gosh, Bill Scarsguard is in Hemlock Grove. He is so cute. It, but definitely an adult peach show. Oh my gosh, what are you guys recommending for me? I'm kind of low-key looking forward to it though. And Dope Bit, Dope Dip, thank you so much for the bids. Sending love to you too. And Smee Squirrel, thank you for the bits. You should try Gilmore Girls. It's my favorite show right now. It is between teen and adult. Set during the 2000s, it's super nostalgic. It's about a girl and her mom, who was a teen mom. They live in a really cute small town and the girl is really smart and gets accepted into a school which they can't pay. So they go to a grandma's to get money, money with the promise of having a dinner each week. <gasps> that sounds so cool. It's on Netflix. Okay, I will give that a go as well. Right, let me go ahead and load into the game. I sometimes get a crush at the beginning of my game and then it's fine after that. It's kind of just like a thing that happens at the beginning. And as usual, we will go for some kind of fantasy-esque music, I guess. Um, let me find some cool music for you gals. Storytelling. Ooh. Ooh. Strings. Okay, no, not that. <laughs> not that. Um... Where is some genres? There we go. No, not that. Um, spiritual, no. Fantasy. There we go. Okay. <laughs> uh, Perez Julia as well. Uh, thank you so, so much for the bits. I'm so happy you're doing a cheekier series with Dakota. I knew you were a little worried about the not so very cheekiness. Love you so much. Paris, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm having fun. I'm having fun uh, with my cheeky series. Okay, the sim should be appearing in just a moment. There we go. Right, fingers crossed it works now. I don't think it helps that this room's so warm. Right. I think what I will do, a bit cheaty, but just in case we get that issue again, I'm actually just gonna teleport her here. And I'll put these up. There we go, okay. And then buy some things from here, and then buy some things from here. Oh, I could get her a familiar. Okay, we can't afford like great things for you, so for now, you're gonna have to have a magic mop, I'm afraid. Um. Sorry. Oh my gosh, she's gonna be flying around on her magic mall. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. And then I have to just get her the cheapest. The cheapest of everything. So just a basic wood wand. I think that makes the most sense. And then the tomes and stuff. I need to at least get her one tome. I don't think she'd want sadness. Incinerate your oh, send people to fire. <gasps> Emotional stability. You need a high rank though. I'm gonna get that for in the future because I feel like in a house full of vampires that's very useful to have. And shall I get her a butterfly? Yeah, we're gonna age up Klaus stars. I want these two to be similar age, so I will age up Klaus quite soon. Should I get her a butterfly or a hex doll? I'm gonna pull you guys and you can decide. Uh, which familiar? Butterfly or Hextal? Let me know what you guys are thinking. I'm thinking Butterfly because it's so much cuter, but we'll see. 
Uh, Perez, Julia, thank you so much for doing for two months in a row. Five months in total, so with your prime. Happy to you. <gasps> An oopsie daisy. Can we get some hype in the, oops, in the chat for oopsie daisy, please? Thank you so much for donating to the Trevor Project. Yes. Can I get the raven? Oh, sorry, there's a raven too. Wow, the raven's way cheaper as well. Um, I'm just going to do a different poll and we're going to introduce the raven too. Sorry, I don't know how I missed that. Raven, burner, fly, and hex doll. I'm actually going to vote for raven just because it's cheap and also because I like ravens. There we go. Um, Sucker Sims, thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five hundred bits. I appreciate you so, so much. I love your videos. Your voice brightens my day. Stay safe and well. You too. A gamer. Thank you so much for being here for seven months in a row. Ho Hello, Peachy Gamers. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for the seven months. And Dreamers Arcadia, thank you for the bits. Got another Netflix suggestion. Call the Midwife. You're the second person that's recommended this to me. Uh, it's about midwives in the 1950s and it starts then. And it's a good mixture. It's good as a mixture of nurses and nuns. It tackles things that happen in those times and it's set in the east end of London. It's an emotional show. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. Okay. I may have to. I've got loads of shows to give a go now. So this is really cool. Um, I'm just going to reset this bar because it's across my face right now. But I will turn it back on. And thank you so much, Oopsie, for the donation. It didn't trigger your tocophobia. Okay. That's good to know. That is good to know. Uh, right. You guys also say the raven. Okay, amazing. So, um, I'm gonna set this as her preferred wand. And say that we always use wands, and we also always use brooms. And then I'm gonna bind- come over here. And let's bind this familiar. Uh, what should we call our raven? Any suggestions in the chat? Any suggestions? Right now it's called Peck. Rave. Raven. Raven the Raven. Um, Phoenix. As she rose from the ashes. Ooh. That's a good shout, actually, because she did. We need to raise... All of my witches raised from the dead, don't they? Riley. Ebony. Hope. Midnight. Shadow. Grim. Oh. <gasps> Oh, there's something quite cool about Grim. Grim is quite cool. I like that. Bellatrix. A Lucard. I was thinking that at first, but a Lucard is actually a crow, not a raven. And I think they're different birds. Uh, oh, wow. Lots of good suggestions. I like Grim because it will be a good way to protect ourselves from the Grim Reaper. So let's go for Grim. Uh, I'm going to show you guys her inventory. There we go. And I think Grim is now bound to us. So I should be able to go to Familiars and Summon. Oh. Yes, Grim. <gasps> and there is little Grim. Fluffing their little wings away. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do a quick save just in case we get another crush, but I'm hoping we won't. Sometimes I get one in the first five minutes of my game and then it's fine. And then if I send her home now, will she use that broom? I just really... <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh <laughs> what was that? What was that? Um, Mega Megatron's thick thighs! <laughs> Thank you so much for being here for two months with your prime. And Jenny Fiorci, thank you so much for the bitch. You got your first vaccination yesterday. I was a bit feverish, but now I just have a bit of a short arm. I'm so grateful for all the people getting vaccinated and those who make the vaccination for us. Enjoy your wedding planning. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jenny. And um, I hope your vaccination went well, my love. And there we go. Okay. So, we're back home with Little Grim. Um, right now, I'm pretty sure I just gave her a- yeah, she's just sleeping in this bed like so. Uh, where is the rest of the farm? Okay, Klaus is in here. Browsing kid-friendly websites. I'm thinking we probably are gonna age up Klaus pretty early this episode. Um, because I haven't decided yet whether Klaus is gonna, like, bind Kim as a, um cattle. I don't even know if you can do it with a spellcaster. Maybe initially she is bound, but then when she gets stronger she figures out a way to undo it kind of thing. So let me know if you guys like the idea. 
Your t-shirt shipped! Yay, Peachy Anna, I'm glad. Uh, Sakura Stems, thank you so much. One, two, three, four, five hundred bits. I appreciate that so, so much. Um, and I'm gonna have to get my little dude here just to do some tidying of the house. Because this house is haunted. If you're wondering why this house is haunted, this should give you a pretty good idea. Um, we've killed a lot of people. And as a result, we're kind of haunted. Like, it makes a lot of sense. It does make a lot of sense. So, uh, yeah. I think we will go ahead and do a birthday for Little Klaus. Anything else I need to mop up or clear? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. One thing I do need to do is get you out into this garden. Please can you tend the garden? Water everything and harvest all of the death flowers, please. And then you can sell all of the mushrooms. There we go. Okay, perfect. Um, so yeah, that's what happened last episode. Basically, we added Kim, who is our spellcaster. And I'm not 100% sure how things are going to go for Kim yet, but we shall see. And I need to get some offerings for these ghosties. Oh, look, we're being protected by our familiar from the ghosties. What is a good thing to offer to ghosties? Yeah, I will give Kim a death flower too. Everyone in the house gets a death flower. It just makes sense. Like, we've been burned too many times at this point, you know? Oh, where are you? Oh, you're at work. Wait a minute. Get your butt home right now. Nope. Stop being embarrassed about your celebrity home. And oh my gosh, you're still meant to get married for money. I'm kind of tempted to marry him to Violet just to get the payout. How much is the payout? What do you reckon? Food. A soul. Oh my gosh. Offering souls? How do I get souls? Paintings or candles? Like 2k. You got $17,000. See, I could kind of do with $17,000. Oh, he's too tense to do the gardening. Work withdrawals. Okay, I'm going to clear work withdrawals because it's just super annoying. And let's tend the garden, please. Give them Violet's paintings. Okay, what's this one? We can do this one. I'll put this one in his inventory. I don't want to sell that one because it's so pretty. And it was made by Draco, who's obviously now dead. So, right, where is that little ghosty? Is it still there? Yeah, okay. Let's go ahead and attempt communication and then present an offering of a painting. And yeah, Vlad needs to get his money and Kim didn't give us any either. Yeah, Kim's kind of here without really offering any cash. Is there anyone else I could get him married to? I mean, his actual true love is Claudia. He still thinks Claudia is like the greatest thing ever. Oh! <laughs> Not the way she died, though. I don't know. I don't know how to get this cash. We literally have, though, seven hours to decide. So what do we do? What do we do? And yeah, I will get Kim practicing some magic. Good idea. Let's get her practicing. Oops, it was there. Practice practical magic. Wait, why did you just hug Violet? I don't understand. And oh my gosh, I missed spellcasters. I like spellcasters. I just think it's a vibe. Marry off Kim. Ooh. A wedding in the garden to Violet. Literally just for the money. Blissfully clean. I don't know what to do with Viola. I'm a bit like, I don't really know where her story is gonna go, you know? Ooh. Oh, well done. Scrubberoo! Yes! Okay, that was a great first one to learn. Because now, Kim, I hate to break it to you, but this is kind of one of the reasons we've got you around. Oh, it's because this door is locked, I think. Uh, you can now help us clean the house. This is a very good, um, oh, I can't reach that. That's annoying. This is a good, like, uh, person to help helping around the house, right? 
Oh? Oh, okay. Kiddo, I need you in here, please. Oh, you're offering to the to the specters? The specters don't really like him, which is quite annoying. Let's try again. Red for blood on the lights. Okay, let me go red for blood. There we go. We've got some blood red lights behind. Looking very vibey. Giving poor Riku a break. I know, right? How old is Riku at this point? He's uh, 22 days until he ages up. I don't know if I've turned aging off for him, though. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, but you've made a little friend. Oh, it's off. Oh, it gave him... Oh, hello. Oh, that's his mum. Nicole is here. Hi. No, stop breaking stuff. Oh, man. Oh, sorry. I'm a little bit behind with you guys. Um, Sakura Sims, I caught your one, two, three, four, five hundred bits. Thank you so, so much. Social Riot, thank you for the five minutes of your prime. Hey, five. Lillian, thank you for the bits. You ordered your peachy t-shirt like four days ago, but for to tell you, that's amazing. Thank you so much, Lillian. And, um, it's been two years since I joined this community. I've been watching on YouTube for five. Love you so much and wish I could have a clan million dollar hug right now. Oh my gosh. Yes, two million dollar hug. Big hugs. And Raiden Hubert, thank you so much for me for six months in a row. Happy six months to me. I'm so happy you decided to get Twitch to see more of you. I've been subscribed since before you played Sims. Thank you so much, Raiden. And Nick Michelle, thank you for the resub and for being here for two whole months. Hope you've had an amazing two months. Um, oh, Kim got some happy dust as well. Oh. Yeah, I don't know if that's from her familiar or from the ghost. The Spectre liked her. Okay, Spectres seem to like her. No, we're not trying that again. Oh, vampires can't offer their soul because they don't have one. Oh, I totally forgot about that. Nicole will never, uh, sorry, Draco can never offer his soul to a Spectre. Huh. Well, there you go. Find a rich person and marry him off. We're kind of struggling though to find rich folks. We only got seven hours. And right now he's just freaking out, being terrified and naked in the shower. Um, okay, Kim. I'm gonna need you to go and make a cake, please, for Draco. Bake. No, not bake. Cook. My most annoying pet peeve of Sims. A cake for Draco, please. Is Draco dead? Well, yeah, I guess so. He's a vampire. Vampires are dead, right? Also, he's thirsty. Oh, jeez. Please tell me you got a death flower in your inventory. <gasps> okay, he might eat Kim. I've got to be really careful now with Kim in this house. This is a bit of a dangerous house for Kim to be in. Um, Please harvest a death flower for yourself, just in cases. Did I say the wrong name? Class. Oh, my gosh. Draco is dead. Klaus is also dead, but in less of a permanent fashion. Yeah. Oh? And we got a last exception. My game is just so beautifully buggy. Love that so much. Okay, you can practice spells for like another couple of minutes and then that's it. You're almost at level... Nephilite already. Neophyte. You're almost a neophyte already. That's pretty good. Nice. Shall I let her just get to this level? There you go. Good job. Good job. Did it give us another spell? We do have a talent point. Oh. Knowledge. Blender. Discharge. Forager. Or experimenter. I'm going to go for experimenter. That sounds super useful. And do we get another spell? No, we didn't get another spell. Oh, well. Still. Pretty amazing. Um, what are Kim's traits? Kim is a bookworm, outgoing, sage, lover, quick learner, champion. She is an ENFP, enthusiastic, creative, and sociable free spirits. And yet, she has to work for vampires. So that's kind of sad for her, right? 
Claire hopping good for every now. Stop. Um, Nick, Michelle, thank you so much for the two months in a row. Estrella, Lilla, thank you so much for the bits. Oh, Been watching you for a while now, but can't um, actually support you with bits and subs. No need to. You just being here is wonderful. I'm glad I found your channel back when James has just met Selma. I loved your journey and all the characters. I hope you have a good day. Thank you so much, Estella. And Dragon Tears Fall, thank you for the bits. Find a rich person to marry and then eat them. Uh, oh my gosh. Riku would probably die of sadness if I did that. He's he's talking to this doll. <laughs> I mean, who can I find to see if they will marry him? Who could be rich? That person's married. That person's married. This Reina isn't married. I could always see if they want to get married. Or do I marry Nicole? Uh, Violet, sorry. I don't know. What do you guys reckon? I don't know which one to do. Oh, a spectre. A spectre's d a daily reward is what caused it. Make a club and add rich people. What, can you have a club where like you have to be rich to join? You only have 20 minutes left. Oh, <gasps> seven minutes. Oh, okay, it's probably not gonna happen, guys. It's, I, uh, it's probably not gonna happen. I mean, it was a nice little dream for little Riku to have for a while, but let's face it, he, he's never gonna get married, gang. He's never gonna get married. It's just, it's just not in his future. He will always just be married to this house and to the jobs that we give him. A dragon tears fall. Thank you so much for the bits. Um, find a rich person tomorrow and eat them all. Yeah. <laughs> and Estrella, I love your journey with your characters. Hope you're having a good day. It's so sweet. Happy little tree. Thank you so much for being here for eleven months in a row at tier two. I hope you're doing well as well, my love. Thank you so much for the tier two support. Almost a year. Marty Sloth, thank you so much for the five months. High five. And Patricia, thank you so much for being for three months in a row with your Prime. And Emily Faye, thank you so much for being here for three months in your Prime as well. I'm doing good. I hope you're doing good as well. Okay. We are all ready for little Draco to age up once he gets home from school. So, um, let's go ahead and... Oh, you got work too. You are quite tired. Well, let's just do um, a super cell so I can get some cash and then tend to your garden, please. You can make a rich people club. Well, I guess whoever Draco marries will have to be rich to bring some money into the household, right? To start the next heir. He's just scared the whole time. <laughs> the house is super haunted, though. <laughs> Um, Chicken Nugget, thank you for the three months. We've been on Twitch for that long, but I've been with you on YouTube for almost four years. A show for you to recommend it is called Panic. It's on Amazon Prime. I recommend watching the trailer because it's hard to explain. So many good recommendations today. Thank you. Klaus! Oh my gosh, did I say Draco again? What am I like? Uh, uh, just copy the classmates. Um, what am I like? Why can I not get game uh, names right? It's so hard. It's actually so hard to get a name right. I'm just terrible. I'm actually just terrible. And it really annoys me that vampires get scared of ghosts. I feel as though vampires should not get scared of ghosts, you know? Uh, this plate is annoying me. And ooh, if you listen to the teacher at school, you learn new skills. So I'm gonna get them to listen to the teacher. And Kim is eating a sandwich in the bathroom. Like, I don't think Violet's gonna care. Honestly, I don't think she is. Violet is hungry though. Both of them are hungry. There's no tourists. <gasps> oh, that's our uh, mage. I've never successfully managed to eat her. But I will try it. I'll give it a go. She's like, nope. <laughs> nope, not for me. Yes, sure I did, friend. Um, Charmix also, thank you so much for being for eight months in a row. And Victoria Road, thank you so much for being for three months. I tried to say, oh, Death Dance, hello, Death Boogie. I just wanted to say thank you for being you and bringing joy to my life. And I just wanted to say my three year old daughter loves you. And she gets, she loves to get so excited when you woo woo. Have a wonderful day. I love that so much. 
Um, oh my gosh, I've just realized I've sent you out into the sun, like a big idiot. How many times am I gonna do this? Have you got time to do quick nonoms? Hopefully this works. If not, there is, no. I keep getting an error. Please don't take away my ability to kill people. That was just like so rude. Don't take that from me. Look at me just chasing her. I don't think this mod works anymore, guys. There's something wrong with the, with the animation. No. I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill anyone. Yay! It's worked! Okay, it's worked now. It just takes quite a few goes. To be fair, this made us somehow service to house for a long time without being eaten. So, this kind of makes sense. This is fine. I will check if the mod needs updating. Uh, Mikey Super Sus, thank you so much for the vids. Will you upload this house to the gallery? I will do when I finish it, but I'm not there yet. And Charnix, thank you so much for the eight months. I've still got like quite a lot to do. So the front is looking okay, but like there is still a lot I gotta do on the back. We've got like this conservatory for the plants, but like the back of the house is looking quite messy. And you need to get inside. What are you doing? Get inside the house. Big Egypt. Go there. Yeah, today's video is coming and it's gonna be late though, guys. Violent Violet has returned. Uh, we're probably gonna get Violent Klaus though, cause he's hungry. What day do child support payments come through? Um, Because Vlad needs to pay his child support. Where is my child support at Vlad? I know you're a loner, but still. There's Draco, this is why I keep getting confused. There's Ruff, living his best life. Are you aging up? You should be. Hopefully you do age up. And... You're off to go moan Maya. Grim is out here taking our maid away for us. You like the spooky music? Money tree. Oh my gosh. I forgot I grew a money tree. Wait, no, 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 Ralph. Not now. Where is... The is this the money tree? Oh. It's still not giving me anything. Uh, come on, money tree. I need some money. I might see if I can, oh, I've got bills to pay as well. We've shut the power off to the house. I might see if I can put some fertilizer on it or something. I can't pay the bills. Well, you're supposed to be at work. Go to work. Go to work and earn us some money. I need it, desperately. You should be working hard. You heading to work? Good, right. Work hard. Nice. There's a mini tree. Ooh, Blaine, hello. There's a mini tree inside the greenhouse too? Nah, they're all lemon trees. This is the only money tree. Wait, that's a pear tree! Where is my money tree? Did I definitely grow one, guys? It didn't die, did it? Did I get one? <laughs> Maybe I never got one. Maybe I just thought I got one, but I actually never got one. Who would have got it? It would have been Riku, right? I think it's Riku's money tree. Yes. What just happened? I do not know. I seem to remember you getting it. I planted it somewhere. Maybe it's just still baby. Our spinaches have died.
He's honestly been neglecting this garden. I'm not impressed. He has been definitely neglecting the garden. Oh. I'm kind of tired, which sucks because I do want to duel this guy with his cool face paint. But I'm tired. I'm sorry, I'm way too tired. Far too tired. Okay, you need to go to bed, babes, because you're just tired. And when you're tired, you're annoying. So do some sleeps. Sleep. There you go. The, the one in front of the grave. Death flower. <gasps> there it is. It's still very baby for now. I'll see if I can fertilize it when I get home. Oh my gosh, she's out in the sun. Yeah, she's out in the sun. When you're tired, you're annoying. Yeah, I got really worried then. I couldn't remember. Dev Hope, thank you so much for the five months. Hello. Yeah, I was getting a bit panicky as well. Like, oh my gosh, where was it? Um, but it's fine, we found it. And um, Violet's feeling a little bit sudge. She's always such Oh. I need you to learn Repario. Sleep quickly. Because I need you to learn Repario to start repairing things. Because this is super annoying. And Riku, now you're home. Oh my gosh. Why are all the humans so sleepy all the time? It's so annoying. I miss him being able to do the ghost repair, to be honest. But yeah, it's so annoying. And Klaus is also having a sleep. And very thirsty. He's sleeping here. Can I come over and hang out? Yes, Donovan! Perfect timing, because I'm so thirsty. So thirsty. Okay, let's head downstairs. Thanks for hanging out. I'll talk to you later. Nope. Don't. Whoa, what a minute. Wait a minute. How are you already here? I don't know. But... Good timing! Wait, you're Blaine. Oh, this is Blaine who we brought back home from school. Oh, Sorry, Blaine, but I need to eat you because I'm thirsty. Thanks, Blaine. It's either Blaine or this other kid. One of them's getting eaten. Maybe even both of them. Sometimes the kids can survive. I don't know why he suddenly got ginger hair. The music went from creepy to heartbeat. It is a bit strange, isn't it? Should I flick this one? There we go. What are you feeling sad about? I like this music. He is, he's got red hair for some reason. And this like rig out on, I don't know. It's really weird. Be careful with Rapario, because if it goes wrong, it can start fires. Good tip, thank you. An AC in Wonderland, thank you for the bits. Full Violet, Raph should trick her into drinking a life potion and move her to Solani so that everyone is safe and so that Violet can learn to live again. Because Riku is Klaus's guardian, not Violet's. This is very true. <gasps> Blaine survived. This is what I mean. Sometimes. Blaine did not survive. But I don't think kids can die this way. However, I'm not having two witches. Just. Nah. No thanks. Ooh, he was very tasty though. Very tasty. Okay, instead of witnessing death, we've got a birthday to celebrate. So let's get our little butts onto here, please. Because I want to see what you're going to age up like. I wonder if I have to... If you look like Vlad, will I have to do any tweaks? We shall see. Lucifer is meowing. Lucifer's got food. He's fine. Lucifer's afraid. We don't care about some random kid. Hello? There we go. I feel bad because Blaine is actually such a cool name. And he did look like quite a cool kid. But I was thirsty, you know? I was very thirsty. Very thirsty. Kevlar, thank you so much for five months. Peachy goodness growing. Hope you are well and loving the streams. Thank you so much for five months. Happy five. Hey, five. Oh, he died. He actually did die. And oh my gosh, my camera's about to overheat. Goodbye. I 
told you it was hot in here. Okay. Um, bye. <laughs> Give my camera like a minute. Um, and then it will switch back on again. But right now it's a little bit too hot. Um, okay. I don't want this cake to go off. So, let's have a little birthday with little violence. And um, little Klaus. Uh, Klaus chit chat with Grim. I mean, it just run in the family, so I will allow it. What is this outfit? <laughs> what even is this? It's not very... Klausy, I would say. But you're gonna blow- Oh, you're awake as well. You can come watch this too then. Come everybody far and wide and watch little Klaus blow out the candles. Yeah, my room's very hot, so... Don't worry, Clay, you look really cute. <laughs> yeah, Sims do have terrible clothes choices. Right, let's see if it'll work for a bit now. And let's, hello. Let's uh, blow out the candles. Um, hello, do you not want to watch me blow out the candles? So rude. Uh, wow, I, this is why you're going to become cattle. Okay, Kim? This is why you will be cattle. Washa! And Klaus? Has aged up. I'm not hopeful. But let's see. If we have to tweak, we will tweak. Okay, should I do best of three again for the traits? Hello again. <laughs> uh, should I do best of three for the traits? And what should we do as an aspiration? I don't know what to do. Master Vampire. Wise and Powerful Vampire? Knitting. Mansion Baron of Fabulously Wealthy? Klaus, oh my gosh, he is really tall. He's really tall. What? Yeah, his dad is, is Klaus, so, um, Vlad, oh my god. His dad is Vlad, so he would want to be a master vampire, wouldn't he? Okay. Right. I'm gonna do best of three. Let's see what we get. So, one. Hates children. Two. Paranoid. That conflicts with brave. So, three. Self-assured. Right. Let's see what you guys are thinking. Uh, paranoid, self-assured, or hates children. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Klaus is Klaus is tired. <laughs> Kali, Christine, thank you so much for three months in a row, four months in total. And Tatiana, thank you so, so much for donating to the Trevor Project. And also, um, is that Lily? Lily also thank you so much for donating to the Prima Project. Can we get some hype in the chat for them, please? Modern Warfare 2 girl, thank you so much for the bits. Just finished my working experience for the day. Hope you're having a good day and you always cheer me up. And go for Master Vampire and happy Friday month. I hope your first day of, uh, first, uh, um, work experience went well, my love. Okay, let's see what you got. Oh yeah, I spelled trait really well. Okay, you guys are thinking either self-assured or hates children. They're both quite interesting. Um, the legacy trait decided it took too long and it kept giving everyone the same traits. It kind of got a bit boring. So, no, we just went for this instead. Trait with a J. <laughs> okay, self-assured. I think that makes sense. Oh, oh no. I like how he was like, ring, ring. He's very tall and skinny. He's very Vlad. He's interesting. I am not above editing my Sims. We've done it on every single one of these Sims so far. What is this music? The nose is interesting. Um, we may just switch. Thirst may make us switch how he looks a little bit. Let's see what we got. 
Juma. <laughs> oh my god. Taz! Hello! Thank you so much for the raid! Could we get some hype in the chat for Taz, please? Welcome, my little Tasmanian devils. Hello! How was your stream? Taz, this is where Alpha CC will bring you one day. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The heart! The heart! <laughs> oh wait, let me just take this heart off. <laughs> my gosh yeah it's has you've started downloading alpha cc i'm just worried for your future because this is what your future will bring you the hearts the heart is so funny um i don't like this bro wait a minute <laughs> where did it always go Oh, this is your dark form. Okay. <laughs> Why is his nose different? Why is your nose completely different? Like, I've never had them actually have that different features before. This is more what I was expecting. That, you've got like an angry vampire. Why is that completely different? His vampire form is a different person's face. So look, this is vampire form. This is human form. Like the real one exists somewhere in between. Can I like copy sim form to dark form? Okay, there we go. And then I know that nose is from Vlad. I don't mind him having like the Vlad nose, but the Vlad nose is like this. Actually, it's not even like that. It's like somewhere in between. It, it's not what was given to us, you know? Oh, did I press the wrong thing? Oh, I can't even like see his face because he's so tall. He is so tall! I'm gonna make his head more proportional for his height because he is a very tall boy. And I like my Sims to schmize a bit just because I think it's attractive. He just, I can't see his face. I can't see his face. He's so tall. I don't- <laughs> Make him hot! Make him hot! We may have to shrink him. I- I kind of like him being a tall boy. I'm gonna make his nose a bit bigger. I think I've gone a bit too small with it. What do you reckon? I don't mind the strong nose. It was just a little bit like cartoon proportions at first. And I kind of like a stronger jaw. No, maybe not actually. That is the thickest neck though. Why is your neck so thick? And long? Is his neck really long? He's got... He's got very odd proportions. I don't know why his neck's so long. He is still a teenager. You can lift his shoulders up. How? Oh. I can widen them, but I can't lift them. I can't like pull them up. I can't like get them up. It won't let me. He needs, well, I think a wider shoulder and chest. It's because of the Vlad bod. He's got Vlad bod. <laughs> 
You're on sleepwear, thank you. Let me switch to uh, regular wear. The clothing in Sims, I swear to God, I can't. I'm gonna take his top off to make sure I don't accidentally give him boobs. And, okay, let's just work some skin details on him. Vladbot. <laughs> The outfit was so bad. Okay, let's remind ourselves of how he looked as a kid. Trust us to join just when I've got a rude hat on. I didn't mean to be wearing a rude hat, okay? It just happened. It just happened. Um, okay. Here is, t here is child class. I actually can't remember the skin details he had on him, though. I know he's got these eyes, actually. He's got those eyes. That's it. That's the only thing I know. Link the forms. Oh. There we go. I don't mind the angry um, um, vampire eyes, though. Posture check. Thank you, Kathleen. And Starcross, thank you so much for being here. Let me get my flowers. Thank you so much for being here for 12 months. Hope you've had an amazing 12 months. Have some flowers. And uh, Kikes, get Kikes Games, thank you so much for being here for four months in a row. Wolfie Fire, thank you for the vids. Glad to catch your stream. It's been a while since, but I have good news. My hours are changing to evenings and days. So I'll be able to catch your streams a little more, hopefully. But not Mondays, but happy Friday month and love to all peaches. Wolfie, that's awesome news. Hope what's going to okay, my love. Um... Yeah, does anyone know what I used to give him? Like, as he skin details? Or should I give him a bit of more of a grown one anyway? That's got a little hair on his chest. I like this skin detail a lot. That's what I call the Makoa skin detail. But I can't remember what he used to have. Kind of digging that one on him too, to be honest. Uh, we'll end up with something good. He does have nice lips. Don't worry, guys. You're in safe hands. You are in safe hands. I will get you a good-looking money. Um, I think he might have been a goo goo. I think he might have had goo goo overlay actually. That's nice too, though. Oh, guys, we're, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll we're gonna make this work. We're gonna make this work. Already. Already. You are in safe hands. <laughs> I'm in safe hands. <laughs> you are. You're in safe handies. Safe handy fundies. This is nice because it has a bit of extra texture. What? He's just massive. He's just massive. There's just a lot of him. You know? There is a lot of them. Um, you better not be on the same layer as my noses. I don't think you are. Where's my noses? They're here. He is a big manine. A very big manine. At least I see a little bit more of Maya now. He is really tall. He's very, very tall. Um, some of these skin- wait, why has he just gone- oh, what have I just pressed? I just overlaid one of his skin details, haven't I? What did I have on him? Oh no, which one did I have? Wait, let me just go back. There we go. This is close. Yeah, this is close. Yeah, I think there's a little bit more of Maya coming back now. Which is good. Might go for that option, actually. Hmm. Hmm. It's got quite a high voice. Nerebu. Grash. I think Draco had quite a high voice as well. 
Yeah, we can see more of his mom now. <laughs> Nicole and Vlad, yeah. Wait. Yeah, it was Nicole and Vlad. I can see a lot of Nicole, actually. I can see a lot of Nicole. Okay, are we gonna stick to the light hair? I'm just gonna hide this banner while we're in cast because I feel like it's quite hard for you guys to see the whole thing. There we go. And soften his eyebrows a little. Okay, this is our boy is coming back. Our boy is returning to us. Don't worry. He's on his way back again. He is on his way back again. There we go. Yeah, I can see rough. I can see a lot of rough. I think he has the same skin as Nicole. The same skin color as Nicole. Yeah, I think he does. I'm not gonna change his skin color. It's quite red with my shaders, but I'm not gonna change his skin color. Um, do you light for his light form and- Okay, we'll do both hair colors then. Oops. I wanna like thicken his eyebrows. I can't always grab the bit I need to grab though. Might just be on this side. There we go. I like a good strong thick brow. Okay. Don't worry, he's hot now. Good. <laughs> um, I might give him just like a little bit of side burnage. Some chops. Bit lighter. There we go. Honestly, we didn't have to change much. I just make his eyes slightly bigger. Yeah, we, we only really changed his nose and then put the skin details back on him. He looks kind of apathetic. I agree. He looks like he doesn't really care, which I think is quite perfect. I use the bright shader, so I'm going to try and turn it on and off for you, but I always forget what button it is. Oh, there we go. So this is how he actually looks. My reds are honestly a little bit too strong. Um, RGB. But I don't really know how to change it. Yeah, my red I always notice my reds are too strong. Whenever it comes to making thumbnails, I bring them into Photoshop and it's just like <laughs> straight away. It's so strong. But it's nothing on here specifically changes red. Oh, RGB balance. Again, that's barely changing a thing. It's just, it is just how it is, I'm afraid. But yeah, before and after. I just like really, I like a lot of saturation. I like a lot of saturation, so. Um, Kikes Games, thank you so much for your four months in a row. Caitlin, thank you so much for your four months. Sorry for not being on our stream as much. My husband and I had our son on May 25th. Thank you for always being there for us and I hope you're doing well. Caitlin, that's incredible news. Congratulations to you and your husband. I hope your new son is doing well. Um, I turned down the red as much as I can, so here we go. Right. Klaus has aged up. He's, because he's tall, his arms go into his torso a little bit, but I think that's okay. I like that he's like still like, he's got like a skinniness, like teen skinniness about him, which I think is pretty good as well. Um, I'm just gonna probably give him some like more realistic lips. Not those ones. I have such a mare trying to find lip color that's meant to just look like just lips alone. Hmm, I don't think any of these are gonna fit him. Which is a shame because I like these ones because they look really like scuffed. Like boy lips, you know, boys that don't look after their lips. Although I kind of slowly feel like Klaus probably uses lip balm. Okay, there we go. Look, look how real they look. Look at those lips. Gorgeous! And... His eyes I'm kinda like vibing with. 
I don't really want to change out his eyes. Maybe for his vampire form, we will. But for this form, I'm more than happy with these eyes. And... Okay, how did Klaus dress? Klaus dressed somewhat traditionally. But we're now on Gen 4 or 5, so we can start, like, moving out a little bit, but with an air of, like, traditional. So I'm thinking, like... Maybe something like that. Like this. So it's still very formal. Like, we're not about to, like, go dressing in this. Because we're still a vampire, the standards. But we could go for something like this, so it's somewhere in between. His left arm is glitching because of the height slider. He's really tall. Yeah, I think maybe something like this. So it's still, like, dressy. I don't think uh -huh. I don't think we're at the generation yet where he's not gonna be like formal. That's like a few generations down the line still, I would say. Something like that. Ooh. Classy but modern, exactly. And I wanna make sure he's got his teeth though. There we go. Okay, I'm actually very happy. I am actually very happy. Yeah, he was made by Re I'm gonna save ah. eyeliner and stuff for his ah. vampire form. And then... Okay, no. Hard no. Wait, is this even longer? Which one did I give him? Okay, for his formal, it will just go a bit longer. <laughs> Yeah, even longer for formal. But he's always going to dress very formal anyway, because he's a <laughs> powish vampire. And then... I don't really care about doing all of these. It actually annoys me having to do them all. But he wants to stay out the sun, so I feel like he'd probably put something on that covers a lot of him. Um, so there we go. Sleepy. Where's your hair gone? Why would you not have hair on for bed? This feels unfair. I gotta go find the hair. We'll give him some little to Tommy Hill figglers. Oh, he's lost his bun. Oh yeah, I never stopped to look at the hairstyles. Do you like this hairstyle or should I give him a bun bun? Because he did have a little bun bun. Or we could release his hair from his bun and have it down. Like this. It almost is a bit too soft, though. Doesn't help that the music sounds very soft as well. These are like some bun bun options. Hmm. That's basically my hair. The OG one. I kind of like the hair he just came with. But he was a bun bun. He was a wearer of bun buns. First or let down? Which was the first one? I don't even really know what hair he had. Hmm. Was it that? It was this, right? I kind of like this on him. Yeah, this music's honestly a bit mud. Um, I kind of like this on him. Is that what he had first? It's very pretty, this hat, yeah. Yeah, it's quite stylish. I, th I agree. There we go. He's got it for bed now. Do not know what the music's doing. A party look. <laughs> Wait, what's his colour? What's Raph's colour? Uh, what's Klaus's colour? Can anyone remember? Red. Red, red, red. Do -do -do -do. What is this music? Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> oh man, that's serious a vibe, but it's pink. I need red. 
Um, any reds? No, it's too untailored. We need tailoring. We need nice tailoring. That'll do. We love a bit of tailoring. His arm is so glitched in certain outfits. Um, okay, let me see if I can bring some- Oh, red! Perfect! I accidentally made him red anyway, so that's fine. Right, swimwear. I don't know why I even have a swimwear outfit, because you're a vampire, you're never going to swim. And then hot weather. Uh, again, you're a vampire, so you wanna, you're going to want to stay covered. Red suit. Oh boy, I'm in danger. <laughs> Okay, I'll go a bit more casual in the summer because it's warm. Do vampires even feel the warmth though? I'm kind of feeling no. But we'll just just for variation's sake. We'll give him a slightly more summery outfit. There we go. Light colour change to red. We're already on red though. A lot, uh, if you want to pick another one, Ella, we can do a different color. And then cold weather. Can I get this in any red colors? Mm, I don't think so. I do miss this kind of dress because it's just so sharp, right? Not me simping over a sim again. <laughs> It's how we roll. Oh, that looks nice and warm. Yeah, let's do that. Nice and warm floof. Floofy warmth. Wow. Wow. There we go. Nice and warm. He's got little earrings. Should we give him little earrings? What do you guys reckon? Should I give him some little earrings? He's so hot, I love him. <laughs> Put him in a hot pants and give him earrings. I like his long coat fashion. I That is very, to me, like, top tier. Is it too early for earrings? Maybe it is. We're still quite a low gen. Although he would look great, I think you're probably right. I think it's a bit early. Earrings. Although vampires kind of earrings. I don't know. I don't feel like we're there yet. I don't want him. I don't think we're there yet. But let's go ahead and check out his dark form. Why is his dark form so different? Copy sim form to dark form. What's going on with your shoulder? Like, what are the- are these your traps? Skinny legend. He's got the biggest traps I've ever seen. Okay, this is the fun bit though. So, you guys wanted to do a dark haired version for this form. It's gonna be so confusing when we see him and we're like, wait a minute, who's, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Um. So we go for a darker hair option. He dyes his hair every time he becomes a vampire, and then he undyes it again. Uh, <laughs> and then... Some eyeliner, I'm thinking, too. Oh, that's his eyelids. His body looks different. It does! I agree, and I don't really know why, but I can see that, too. It's annoying. It doesn't always copy across very well when you like specify a form. He's I also think his eyes are smaller as a vampire. If that makes any sense. But I do feel like they are. Is it too early for makeup? What do we reckon? You can del delete the dark form and then start it and then re-instigate it. Um, 
Yeah, everything's ticked. That does not change whatsoever. It's never too early for makeup. Okay, okay, okay. Which one did I put on? This one. There we go. Oh, purple since it's already red. Okay. Right, let's do purple. There we go, some purple lighting in the background. And he needs to be more scary. Okay, let's go to some of these options. So let's make sure he's got his teeth. He does. Skin vampire brows. Will these show? They don't always show. Which sucks, because I like the angry vampire brows. Nice. And then if I unlink them, can I give him angry eyebrows when he's in vampire form? Oh, I love the veins. Yes, veins. I love the vampire veins on the face. Because I feel like they should. Like, you have to be noticeably vampire. Why is your chin different? Or do you actually just have quite a short chin? I don't think his chin is noticeably short in this form. Maybe a bit? But then when he's a vampire, his chin looks really short. I don't get it. That's definitely shorter. That's a bit too long, but. I don't know if it's because like, you're framed by a darker top bit. I agree that his eyes look smaller as a vampire and I don't know why. It might be the makeup, I don't know, but he looks different, I agree. Can I put any more, like, creepy skin details on him? Vampire mouth. <laughs> nom nom nom! And then... Okay. Can I give him like hollow cheeks? I can't. They're not that obvious though. There we go, okay. And... Some of these eyes don't show, which is super annoying. Oh, they do. Oh, that's quite scary. That's quite scary. What, what are you telling me? What's wrong? You started editing him before you linked the forms. But he should be the same because I copied him over at the start. I don't get it. All oh, things, Sammy, uh, Sammy B. Thank you so much for for six months. Happy Tuesday, beautiful peaches. I've been away from Twitch and social media for a little while, but your videos are always a must. Thank you for inspiring me and brightening our days. Oh, thanks, uh, uh, Sammy B. Thank you so, so much. And, oh, Amy, sorry. All oh, things Amy B. I need to stop doing that. Amy, thank you so much. Uh, King Pluto, thank you so much for three months with your Prime for records. Thank you so, so much for the um, 12 months. Wait, is that right? No, two months. <laughs> Have some flowers anyway. Thank you so much for the two months. Much love to you, Glenn Chat. I hope it free has a good day so far. A Jerjury, thank you so much for being here for 11 months. Almost a year. Sierra Nicole, you are 12 months though. One year, flowers. There we go. Thank you so, so much for hanging out with me for a whole year, Sierra. I hope you've had a good one. And Rita, thank you so much for being here for six months in a row. Hope you've had an awesome half a year with the peaches. Uh, the copy didn't work as you were in sleepwear. Do they look dramatically different? Yeah, the shoulders are smaller, aren't they? All it's 
is changing is his hair, though. His body type doesn't change at all. I think I'm just gonna have to do it manually. He's way different. He's way different as a vampire. I just don't get it. That's so weird. And he still wears no hair, hair to bed. <laughs> He's like me, taking his hair off for bed. Oh, I kind of like his hair like this though. His head's smaller too. Hear me out though. Vampire form. Is his waist really small? I don't want to delete and start all over again though. Let me just see if I can copy it over instead. Let's see if I can like just, he is really skinny, but he's like, he's a teenager. He's only just aged up. We can try and get him to like beef out a little bit, but right now he's just a teenager. When I was a teenager, I was like tiny because I just grown a bunch, you know? He's a bit dehydrated. The sliders are the same. This is what makes no sense. His waist. Oh my gosh, his waist is really small. It's even thinner in that form. Okay. I hate it when it does two different forms. Even his legs are thinner. Everything's thinner when he's a vampire and he like starts like, uh, I don't know, channeling blood. Get a home gym. Yeah, I will probably try and buff him out a little bit. But there we go. We've at least got vampire form. He is a skinny legend. <laughs> Rita, thank you so much for the six months. And Hannah, Hannah Kavana, thank you so much for the three months of your prime. I've been watching your streams for a year, but I've only been able to sit for three months. And I've been watching since the beginning of Dream House. Sending lots of love and I hope you're doing amazingly. You too, Hannah. Thank you so much. Uh, his dark form could be skinnier because of the old blood system from Vlad's, like in old vampire times. Exactly. Uh, it probably is the mermaid glitch. My mermaids get skinnier and skinnier and skinnier every time I go into cast. It's very annoying. I think we're good, though. Yeah, teenagers do look ridiculous in Sims. Especially when they're as tall as him. But we are done. He is grown. He is grown. Done. <laughs> I like how he looks though. I am pleasantly surprised by how he looks. Occult form makes him skinnier and skinnier every time you do it. Yeah, it's very annoying. Um, it happened to me a lot when I played at Island Living with who was my mermaid girl in that? Um, she just got ridiculous. She just got tinier and tinier and tinier. Every time I like added a necklace to her mermaid form or removed a heart. She just got smaller and smaller and it was really annoying because like I had no idea then at what like what she originally looked like and I was kind of yeah Ari. It happened really bad with Ari. So yes. I'm glad you like how I dress my sims Miss Buggy. I just it, we, it's mainly done for the purpose of simp reasons. And here we go. Here he is. Just vibing about being a long boy. He is the longest sim. Like, the longest sim I think I've had in a while. You are very long. Ooh, yeah, it's deep. it's your grandma. You are a long boy. <laughs> a very long boy. Okay. <laughs> long boy is here. Long boy has arrived. Okay. You are up and about. You're probably the only one in the house who actually wants to eat the cake. So you may have a slice of cake if you like. And then I need you to practice. Um, this was really fun and all. Uh, I need you to keep practicing your magics. Um, because I would like you to get better at practical magic so you can help us around the house. Long and blonde. Exactly. Very Micah energy. Okay, you're going to come and eat your cake here with long boy. Oh 
come on. Don't accidentally kill her. I feel as though he might accidentally kill her. <laughs> I just think it might happen, you know? <laughs> Don't, though. If you can avoid doing that, that would be really, really nice. Do they even... Have they even spoken? They have spoken. Okay. He perceives Kim as attractive. Kim... Kim is not into vampires. Not into vampires at all. Like, not one bit. I've never seen that. Oh, burn. <laughs> um, however, he wants himself a little cattle. So, should I try? Do I have to have a little bit more, like, skill before I can make cattle? Um, I don't know how to do it. I've kind of forgotten how to add cattle. Oh, yes, we've got Rapario. Fantastiche. We've got Rapario now. <gasps> She's actually uncomfortable from looking at him. <laughs> Get out of my eyes! Being around him literally disgusts her. I was kind of low-key being like, oh, maybe when they're older, this might be a little ship, but no. I think he would be more than happy, but she finds vampires disgusting. She is a witch. It is known. That's kind of how they roll. Um, he's just talking to his grandfather there. Um, yeah, how do I make somebody into a, 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 a cattle? I can't remember how to do it. Do I have to get him like studying his like vampire book a little bit? Is it a power? I do have some vampire power points. Poor Klaus, the shade. I know, right? We just tried so hard with him. Witches just hate them though. Witches hate vampires. It's known. It is 100% known. Uh, eternally welcome. Study, he will use less vampiric energy. I think that's a pretty good one. I'm gonna get some of these. There we go. That's too funny. The bat form can get a bit annoying though. Everyone loves a good enemies to lovers plot, but what about ugly to attractive plot? Does that even work? She hates vampires because Violet killed her. I think she hates this family. She's serving them because she has to, but she hates them, you know? She's kind of trapped here unwillingly. I genuinely can't remember how to make a vampire's thrall on this. I can't remember how to do it. I do want to remember though. Can we blame her for hating them though? No, 100%. She's totally in the right. It makes total sense. It does make total sense. Make a show. Thank you for the bids. Will you please play Shadow of Tomb Raider on YouTube? Um, I watched your old Tomb Raider series. Also, are you ever going to finish Marvel Avengers? After watching that stream on YouTube, I got the game. It's still good. It is a really fun game. Um, however, I don't know. I'm kind of, I don't have much space for stuff to play right now. Um, but I will put them in the, the little maybe list. The life spirit power. Yeah, the music. Oh my gosh, thank you for telling me. I didn't realize. The music's very happy. Uh, cattle is one of the vampire points. Oh, is it? I thought it was with the mod. I thought it was with the mod. So I don't know how to do it. I cannot remember. Oh, he's stuck on here again. Stop doing that, big Egypt cat. Change the light color to blue. Okay, let's do some blue lighting. Let's get a little bit of blue. There we go. Blue lights. Am I in focus? I am again. The, ca the camera is behaving a little bit more today. Um, <laughs> it is with the mod, right? It's with the mod. So I thought when I just clicked it, it would be there. But yeah, it's not. I don't know what to do. I can't remember how to do it. You're dead. I literally don't care what you do and don't like. 
I can't believe Lucifer's still alive. Lucifer's been here since the start. Although, yeah. Oh, maybe I do have aging switched off. I genuinely can't remember. Did I switch aging off? It's found in the vampire skill tree. Okay, let me have another look. Vampiric charm, strength, command, immunity, creation, slumber. I think we did it really early when we did it with, um... no, it's not on there. We did it really early when we did it with Claudia. It's life spirit. Ah, manipulate life spirit. Okay. Claire, check her attractive likes and dislikes, please. Okay. Uh, she is sleeping. I, I will check when she wakes up in the morning. It's from the mod, but you do have to manipulate like What? Stop trying to be involved. You're dead, okay? Uh, we do have Rapario, though. So, do we have a bunch of stuff to repair? Okay, sleep for a little bit longer, and then I need you to wake up. Come in here. And let's try and not start a fire. Go here. And let's see if we can try to do Rapario. Because we're going to be able to save a lot of money if we can. Will she fly there? No, she walks there. Okay. Right, don't start any fires and give this a go. Hey, it worked! She's good! <gasps> nice! No fires! Okay, I'm gonna reward you with a buff. There you go. Oh, she's freaked out by something. There you go. Have a little buff for yourself. Oh no, you can't, you're too scared. You heard a creepy voice? Oh, there's a mean spirit. Oh, okay. There is a mean spirit. Please don't get set on fire while you're in the buff. Will these ones only set you on fire if you go too close to them? I can't remember. Posture check, thank you. Needed that. Oh, and we just got um, that kid's grave in here. <laughs> Orion Pan Panagakos. Hello. Right, let's pop this into... Oh my gosh, this is a very haunted house right now. Let's pop you into here. I will stack you at some point. Anybody else got any dead people in their inventory? You do. Nice. Do you have any dead people? Oh, you got four! Oh, well done, Riku. In you go. We are vampires, so we do kill quite a lot of people. It's not our fault. We are vampires. And you've got three! Well done! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine new dead folks. Yay. And you want to go and chat with her. She's going to be disgusted that you even want to talk to her. Like, she literally hates you that much that she doesn't even want you to speak to her. And she definitely doesn't want to be scared by you. He thinks that is the best crack ever. I want to see, like, just how tall he looks because I think... She is like normal height. Kim is like normal sim height. Oh, yeah, he's definitely quite tall. I think it's because we made Vlad tall. That's why. And... Yeah, he wants to just keep pranking her. What is he like? Oh, no, that was her pranking him. Haha. <laughs> she hates you. What is that disgusting smell? Is it you? Are you smelling yourself? What is this rig art, by the way, Riku? <laughs> Why are you just kind of low-key being a bit of a wreck right now? I don't know. Um, Kim, do you have your death flower yet? You don't. Please come get your death flower. Is there one on that tree? Yeah, harvest this death flower. Have you guys ever seen the death flowers, by the way? They've got a little skull on them. Like so. Death flower. I'm out of focus. Am I? Um, Riku is such a mood. Is, is his nightwear. Close the friendship with selfies. Oh, uh, I'm just kind of going to let them just like vibe out though and do their own thing. Um, develop sims, choose sims. I don't know how to see what she's interested in. I'll get her to scope her surroundings. I don't think she- imagine if she finds Riku hot though. 
That would be very funny. No one's in your surroundings, so how can you scope them? No, I don't think you'd be able to. Hey, honey, can we watch a movie together? Oh my gosh. Why are you still dating? And okay, re um, Klaus, you're our next heir, so you want to become a master vampire? Don't die in the sun. You're meant to be our next heir. Oh, I've not made you burn in the sun yet. I will. Um, so I need you to start searching for information on vampires. I would like one of you at least to master your aspiration before you die. And you know you will die eventually. Oh, we need to pay our bills. So I'm going to at least try and get him to improve like a little bit. No one cares about you. Um, pay your bills. Get a seance table for, for Kim. Oh, that's a good idea. And then you can research this. I need to be able to afford a seance table, which I don't think I can do right now. Let me have a look. I think they're more expensive than that. But yeah, she could have a secret table in her room. I like that idea. Um, paranormal. Seance table. Table of rage? I don't think that- There it is! Okay. I will put this in her room. And then she can like secretly study in here. Because no one would come in and bother her. Because like, no one cares about her. Um. So there we go. Mango, hello! How are you? The house is dark because I don't have auto lights. Because we're already struggling for money so much. Which reminds me, you guys need to get jobs. Uh, why don't you sense a spiritual volatility, vo volata volatility, and then commune with the departed? And you guys need to get jobs. Hello. Why are you not doing your research like I told you to? Please research a vampire's secrets. Oh, Kim's off to school. You're not, though, apparently. Good, jo good job. Claire, look at the household inventory. Oh, we're in Mine of Vampire! Nice. Okay, you probably need to go to school now, though. And we've been on the safe file for 24 hours. Okay, but surely it's more than that. Surely it's a little bit more than that. Oh, you don't have class for 24 hours. Okay, good job. However, I am going to give you... Which one was it? This one, Manipulate Life Spirit. Okay. For now, I will give you... Vampire Charm. Maybe that will work. And I will give you the weakness of the sun, because I like that one. There we go. And what do you need to do next? Read Encyclopedia Vampiratica Volume 1. Who has that? I don't know if we've got that anymore. Yeah, I don't think we've got those anymore. Oh no. Did Raf take them all? Did Raf take them? The music is like the music on Solani. Feed Lucifer. Lucifer's got food. Where is Lucifer? Lucifer's got foodies. He's fine. He is totally fine. He might be off to go eat right now. Yeah, he is. Look, he's doing eaties. What are you doing? Get out the sun. Oh my gosh, you absolute fool. Wish my vampires would stop doing that. Please go and like... Go in your coffin for a bit. Stop going in the sun. Didn't you sell them so he could move? Oh, yeah, I think I did. I think I did. I don't think I've got anything in my house inventory, but I will just check. Becca, thank you so much for for nine months in a row. A Twitch baby and 10 months in total. Double high fives. Yeah, I've got nothing, guys. Oh. Oh, I have things. What's this? Life under a microscope, sell you. Sell you. A chair. Oh, ooh, a winged imp gargoyle. I kind of don't want to sell you. You're kind of cool. Okay, you can hang out on here. You can stay friend, because you're really cool. Um, business card holder, sell. An ATM, so 
A true performance space sell. You can get sold. I have 4,000 pounds. What did I need to spend money on, guys? What? Oh, did we say we were going to give him like a workout room so he can get strong? Vampire strengths. What should this room be? Books or gym or bills. Oh, it's a tough one. Um, this is probably actually just going to be a way to get through. So I need to put one of these on this side because I need to access this part of the house. Uh, yeah, we do need a gym. So we've got all of this space. What is this music? We do have all of that space. What else does a vampire need, do you reckon? A torture dungeon. And a place for tomes. Oh, the bloody pool! Oh my gosh, yes! I forgot about that idea. Maybe we will need swimwear then. Okay, should I try and make a blood pool? Let's try and make ourselves a blood pool. I don't know if I'll have enough money, but I will try. Can I make a pool that's like sunken? Like in a platform? Can I do a platform pool? Like if I get a square platform. A piano room's a good idea too. Okay, and then if I like sync this. Oh wait, you're still really high, go down. Oh no, you're not, you're sunken. Okay, are you? You look higher. You, you look high. Let me just delete this for a sec. It looks high. I want like a pool that's lower. The maze outside as well, yeah. I want it to be less of a platform and more of like a, but not a basement. There we go, now we're going down. And then what happens if I put a pool in it? Does the pool sit really low? Like they're trapped in there? Okay, you can't place a pool on a platform. Disappointing! Okay, never mind. Let's just go for a pool. Cannot place it. What are you talking about? There's no platform there now. It's just one room. Is this different? Oh, I did that by accident. Right, there we go. Is that better now? Okay. I wanted like, you know, the, the pool to be like lower. The whole floor isn't leveled with the house. Am I still a bit too low? Or I am. Um... Right. Well, that was expensive. Can I not do red? This is an expensive extravagance. Oh, your money's gone. <laughs> is this a bit foolish? A pool of Ribena. Blood is expensive. You'd think we'd have enough for a pool by now. I actually think we should have enough for several pools at this point. I just realized I can make this a bit bigger, so it's a bit easier to like, get in and out. But yeah, like, I don't know. I'm feeling victimized right now. Um, This is rude. I don't like that. 
She's a pro, Taz. <laughs> and Elena, thank you so much for being for three months. Just want to say thank you for being such an awesome person. Watching your streams after work is my favorite way to decompress. Lots of peachy love to you. Thank you so much, Elena. And uh, Kumama, Kuma Motorboy, thank you so much for being for five months of Prime. High five. And hello, Ella, your best friend. She's a massive fan and she's been watching for years. Hello. Don't forget a pool ladder. Honestly, I don't feel like I should have to pay for a pool of blood because I've killed so many people. It's honestly quite insulting to the amount of people I've killed to like charge me for this. Uh, but I really want a pool of blood. So I'm gonna make those lights red. How dare it charge me? What an insult to my KD. Honestly. Okay, we will make that red. Um, however, I need some like little torches on the wall. Cheat the money back, it's natural blood. I know, but I don't like cheating. I don't like cheating. I like the fact that the, the point of this is it's meant to be a challenge. It's meant to be quite tough, you know? Um, I need to be functional off the grid. How do I get it so it's off the grid? Hmm. Oh, there's a specific thing, isn't there? Off the grid, there we go. Right, some wall lighting, please. Ooh, and a bit of this. Ooh, maybe some of this. They're not very big, are they? Wait, is that gonna be expensive? Okay, that's all of my money in the world. Give yourself the money back, we will understand. Nah, I, li I like how tricky it is. It, it makes my soul happy. Okay, we can afford one light. Right, kids, you're getting jobs right now. Jobs. Hey, sappity saps. I want your jobs. Jobs, please. Can Kim make money with her magic somehow? Could I have, like, low-key hacked the game with that? Can I, like, change the color of this? Set the color. This room. No, actually, it's just the pool, isn't it? Oh my gosh, game, stop running so slow! Um, set color and intensity. This light. Red. Red. Okay. And then where's the other light? And um, where is Vlad's child support payments? That's what I want to know. Red. It's getting there, guys. This light. Red. And then this light. Red. Does it kind of look like blood? I might need more lights. In some. That looks like blood. Why is it changing color? Someone said make the water clear and have the wallpaper be red. Can I change the color of the wallpaper in the pool? The pool floor. One light's not red. Which one? This one. I know it's orange, but I think like against the pool it will look more red. Let me get someone to go in the room so I can see. Oh, you can't get there? Can't you go here? Oh, no, go to work. Go to work, because I I need the money very badly. In fact, work hard. Uh, listen to your teacher, and you need to get a job right now, Klaus. Find yourself a job right now. I need the money. Sell the pool tiles. Set the pool tiles to red. Okay, we will do that, but right now I have zero pounds in the world. So, oh my gosh, somebody's moaning about not working for free. I will become None of these feel right. Let's do retail employee. Uh, who's moaning about not getting paid? I don't work for free. Oh babes, you've picked the wrong family to moan about that too. Oh, I'm not thirsty enough to kill her. Um okay, we will be killing her though. How dare she? How dare she? And he's off to go talk with his friends in here next to the seance table. 
You don't need to do your homework. No one cares about that. It's fine. Uh, am I behind on any redemptions mods? Ellen, thank you so much for the bits. And Solmente. Menity, thank you so much for the bits as well. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, she has chosen death. For sure. Re oh, I was meant to buy the encyclopedia. Oh. I was meant to buy the encyclopedia, wasn't I? Now I'm thirsty enough. Oh, she just disappeared with her life. Just in the nick of time. Need to get rid of that, but I've got to wait. Maybe the pool should come later. I just really want a blood pool. Wait a minute, why don't I just sell this fountain? Oh, that fountain is worth nothing. Okay, fine. New plan, new plan, new plan. Push your check, thank you. And we have a light change to yellow in the bean corner and blue everywhere else. Okay, so... Um, which one is the bean corner? I think it's this one. Yeah, okay. Yellow in the bean corner. And then we've already got blue everywhere else. So I'll just go for a bit of a different blue. That looks very vibey. Yellow bean corner, blue everywhere else. Hopefully you like those. Check on the money tree. It's trash. It's actually trash. Ugh. I can't believe I sold all those books for Ralph. I'm actually so mad right now. I'm actually so mad. Ah. And I think one of Kim's family members has come around. That is an error. That is such an error. So get Klaus to paint. Oh, that's a good idea. That is actually a really good way to make money. Let's do that. Hey Klaus, can I join the blood bag club? I mean, it's literally just an excuse to kill humans. So yeah, of course you can. And what do prisoners use to call each other? Cell phones, did you laugh? Not only did you become human, but you adopted dad humor. So fair play to you. Um, right, let's go make some money with paintings. Kim is inviting over her classmate. Are you just wanting people to die? Like, oh, I can't paint because I don't have enough money. Uh, Kim, you need a job as well, babes. Please find yourself a job. When's your first day at your job? Two days, oh my gosh. And who is your friend that even brought me home to eat? Who is Floyd? Is this Floyd? It's kind of nice that she's bringing me dinner back from school. I think that's quite cute. Make the witch hunt for crystals. Um, I need to get her to keep practicing magic as well. Because I feel like maybe eventually there's some like, almost like cheats you can do with the magic where uh, you can be a, which one pays the best? 45, you can be a manual laborer. Um, I feel like there's almost like some cheats you can do with the magic where like you can spawn stuff infinitely. So I think we should keep practicing our magic. And I'm going to eat this person. Nice. Such kind humans. I know, right? Okay, she's doing a death boogie. And we'll actually get to see him change his hair color. If it works, it might glitch out. He really wants to go and swim in the blood pool, though. So that's nice. Oh my gosh. Imagine this huge vampire just coming up to you. And there he is, in his little vampire form. He's just been naked all day, by the way. Oh my gosh, he, you literally just biting into the side of her face. That's somehow worse than the neck. That is somehow worse than the neck. I don't know why, but that is weird. And look at her just having to like ignore it all. Just practicing her magics instead. I hope it's not too late. Happy birthday, Kim. Are you, all, are you all wanting to die? What is wrong with you people? I do not know. But Klaus is there, back in his blonde form. Huh? Yeah. Ah. And I never went by to dust. However, I really need this encyclopedia. Can you get anything from her? Like, I need some money. That's her mom. Oh, really? Krista Heller. No, it's not, it's not, it's not. Kylie Keola? 
And Jonathan Roswell. That is her. I don't think this person's related to her. Oh, no, it is. You know her. You know her. It was her aunt. Okay, if she didn't like you before, she's not gonna like you now. You just ate her aunt. Oh, and you can't pretend to be sad now. We know you're not sad. Oh, she's gonna kill him one day. She is gonna kill him one day. She is. <laughs> the pregnancy and baby mod is the woo-woo wellness mod. I added it for the latest episode of Not So Berry. So yeah, that's what that's from. And Violet is back home with some money. Please don't burn in the sun. Uh, we got some money, which is great because now I can purchase volume one of the vampire tomes. And now you can eat them. Uh, you can read them. Oh, it's in her inventory. Boop. And then open and then read and then... We're calling to let you know that Krista has died. I mean, she died right in front of us. We kind of get that. We kind of understood what has happened. And yeah, this it's not very nice living here. I don't know why you chose to come back to life again. Honestly, it's kind of your own fault. You kind of brought this on yourself. Uh, Cozy Free, welcome to the Peaches. Please can welcome Cozy Free, please. Now we know how Klaus dies. I know, I was kind of hoping to harvest her DNA. Um... Someone in our family is like, let's go to the vegan bistro. As much as I would love that, I don't like leaving the house as like a non-vampire, so we won't be doing that. And now you've got to sleep with your aunt's urn in your room. That's not very nice, is it? It's not ideal. We'll go put her in here. We're getting a few ready to go on go on the walls anyway, so it's fine. There we go. Riku earned some good money as well. Riku, I kind of need you to get this promotion. So why don't you come in here, have yourself a little shower, and then I need you to practice chess. Where's the ball on the seance table? Oh, that's a really good point. We don't have a crystal ball. Yeah, we don't have a crystal ball. I don't know. I don't know why we don't have a crystal ball. Does it usually have a crystal ball? And no, we've still got no child support. Like, we've still got no child support. I don't get it. No, I don't know how to see Kim's attractive preferences. Ralph is calling to chat. And oh no, she's really hungry. Uh oh. There's two people in the house to eat though. Floyd is in Bl Blood Blood Club. Okay, but I'm gonna get her to eat this person because you're hungry too, so you do some meaties as well. There we go. And oh, maybe if Kim has garlic in her inventory, they won't eat her. Does that work? There's some garlic here. Ooh, harvest this garlic and put it in your inventory. It'll keep you safe. Yeah, Vlad needs to pay up. I honestly thought he would give us so much money as well. I thought it was like easy gains, but instead he's given us nothing. I don't get it. I don't get it. Why is he not giving us any money? I don't understand. Why is he not giving us any money? Oh, her fa a familiar will re resurrect her if she dies. Okay, brilliant, brilliant. The video is going up. I'm just waiting for some stuff on it yet, though. I don't have the file, I'm afraid. It probably will be up nearer 7. Nearer, like, 7 p.m. I think. Yeah. No, we don't cheat the money. That's the whole point of the challenge. It's meant to be quite difficult. It is meant to be quite difficult. Stop pretending you're sad when people die. Why are you faking it like that? I don't understand. And you've now got to participate in vampire training. Find a vampire that can train Klaus. Okay, you know what? I'm sick of waiting for Vlad. I'm going to invite him to come around. Maybe put some clothes on though. Maybe get a shower, put some clothes on. And then you can invite him around, okay? Get a little shower in here. No, the money for child support should automatically come. I don't get it because in my Not So Berry series, like Ty paid us so much. But in this series, we get nothing. It makes no sense. 
Oh, that person was related to her too. Okay, I did just wipe out a branch of her family. Oops. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was a bit of an error. Sorry about that. Oh no, she's really going to hate us now. She's really going to hate us now. And, um, okay, we've invited Vlad around. Jeez, I was like, you have changed appearance. Oh, you're just rooting through our bins. That's normal. Um, okay, where's Vlad? Where's Vlad? Where's Vlad? Where is Vlad? Oh, he's here. Oh, he came around to mourn Nicole. That's kind of sweet, right? Oh, okay, now it's getting a bit intense. There's a lot of mourning going on. Uh, please, can you train me? Thanks. They are definitely sad about Nicole. Okay, let's see about the similarities between them both. Are they the same height? They are very similar. I'd say that Klaus has softer features than Vlad. And obviously he's got Nicole's skin tone. Wait, do you guys have the same hair? No, you don't have the same hair. It is very similar though. Which one is more your vibe? Are you more of a Klaus kind of girl or guy or, or non either? Or more of a Vlad kind? Which one are you thinking, Gun? Should I do a little poll? Which one? Vladdy, Tati. Or Klausy, Wowsy? I don't know. It doesn't really work. It doesn't doesn't sound as cool for him, I'm afraid. <laughs> Klaus for the win. I want to see which one you guys vote for. But we need to get vampire training. Oh, so this yeah. is perfect. So we can request a uh, vampire training from him and it will help us out with our master vampire skill. Discover Abba, dark birthrights, I... which we should have. You are feeling sad from thinking about um, Maya, though. Oh. That was not training. You both just decided to do a little dance. Please actually train. Oh, you're not in the right emotional state. No, you are. Get us some training, please. You are. You're fine. You'll do. Okay, reach vampire level seven. Defeat three vampires in combat? And become a prime vampire. I guess we can spar with Vlad. I think we'll get our ass handed to us, but we can give it a go. Where is Spa? Hmm, I don't know how to Spa. Ask to turn. You're already a vampire. Okay, now he's training us. How do how do I Klausy Wowsy won! 65%! I think I would agree. I think I would agree with that. Um, yeah, I don't know how to. I don't know how to spar with him. I don't want to fight him because then he will have to die. But like, how do I just do like a little, a little cozy spar? Yeah, I was in friendly. I can ask him for some advice on my biting technique. Um, and brood about being a vampire. Don't get too low on thirst. Yeah, we know all about that. But I don't know how to just do some little casual, like, spas. I sound just being really blind. What do you guys reckon? I can't see it. I genuinely cannot see it. Lucid Kahai, thank you for the four months. I didn't know my sub fell off. Glad to be back in action. Welcome back, Lucid. And the name is ABK. Thank you so much for gifting us so. Please make sure you say thank you to the name is ABK if you were just gifted. Ask for spa training. Yeah, I can't see it. It's under vampire. Weird. I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't want to fight him either because the way I have it in my game is if you like lose then you have to die. So I don't want to do the mean one. I don't want to do the mean one. 
Vlad still wins your heart. That's fine. It's because he's a teen. Ah, oh, so he's got to wait till he's a little bit more grown. Okay, we'll try and get him a bit more grown. And as for Kim, she's got to cast a spell on another sim. Now that we are in Necolite, though, on Neolite. Where is it? Into here. Oh my gosh, why am I so bad at this game? Um, I think I can, she can study this now. So wake up and study this totem, please. She's going to be Sarge for like a whole week, I swear to God. But let's get her studying this massive book. So that she can try and learn the skill that like sorts out other people, other Sims's like emotional states. I don't care, Bryn. Bryn, how was your ghost still here? You were one of the first ones I killed. That makes no sense at all. And you had a dream that you farted in class. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Did you have to go practice your writing? And troll the forums. Good job. Um, I noticed some Huns out here that you need to dispose of, by the way. Get rid of those. Maya is here. I wonder if I can control her. Oh, I thought I'd be able to control her. Oh, I thought I might be able to make her, like, um... Oh, it's Maya! I was gonna say make her woo-woo Vlad, but wrong sim. Wrong sim. We're after Nicole, aren't we? Okay, I'm gonna get him to get rid of these hands. Oh, thank you so much, Hot Bangs! Ah, oh, you too. Uh, all the ghosts do be coming around today. I enjoyed spending this time with you. See you later. You spent more time with Nicole's ghost than anything, but I mean, it's kind of sweet. He's definitely not over Nicole, but still able to not pay child support, which is very annoying. How oh, dare you? I really need the child support. Honestly, that's the most annoying part of this. The most annoying part of all. And I'm gonna see if once I've learned this um, emotional sort out skill, whether she can cast it on herself and it will like help balance her emotions. Okay, emotional stability. Can you do that to yourself? <laughs> okay, Maya. Um, can you cast this on yourself? What? I can't I can't use it on myself. No way. Oh, it's a potion. Oh, this is good. I'll get rid of my sadness. Oh, yes. <laughs> I don't know what this music is. Also very, it's a bit weird. It's meant to be just like a uh, fantasy music, but sometimes it gets a bit odd. Okay. Is that gonna sort out your emotions and stop you feeling so such? There you go. It got rid of your sadness. Now you're feeling focused, which is great. Um, You're also very hungry. So why don't you go in here and eat some leftovers and then go back to bed. But this is good, because whenever any of the vampires are, like, acting up, she can, like, make a potion for them, maybe, if I get her, like, a thing. And then that will be helpful. We will need to get her a potion brew, a machine, though. Um. Let me just check something real quick. Right, sometimes they can't scope the room, which is super annoying. But since he finds her attractive, I like the idea that he's constantly trying to hit on her. And she's just like constantly disgusted by him. I kind of feel like that energy is, I like that energy. Brighten her day. And then like, ask her if she's single. And she's just like, you're gross, I hate you. You're gross, I hate you. You're gross, I hate you. Ask about her attractive preferences. Try and do a bold pickup line. <gasps> Cut food, yeah, good show. Look at him just staring at her, like... <laughs> and she, um, like, you know when you're desperately trying to ignore the fact that someone's, like, looking at you, just like... Hey, <laughs> She's like, hmm, I hate you. You, to me, are so ugly, you actually disgust me with your presence. That's how she's feeling. Although he is charismatic, apparently. But yeah, she hates him. <laughs> I think she just cancelled all of his interactions. She's like, yeah, no, it's not happening. Oh, it's because I sent her to go to bed. I'll, I'll hold off her bedtime for one second. Mm. 
Baba. <laughs> oh, what? It actually works? <laughs> How is that working on her? Is it because he's charismatic? Like, what? Is it because he's charismatic? I thought she would hate that. She finds him deeply unattractive. She hates him. He's killed a bunch of her family members. Oh, okay. I don't understand if it's the potion. Or the fact that he's very charismatic or what, but that makes no sense to me whatsoever. That is just very, very odd. He is smooth like butter. I fed Lucifer, don't worry. How would you warm up to him? He killed her aunt in front of her and then pretended he was Saj when he was not Saj. I just don't get it. I just don't get it one bit. I do need to get an auto feeder. The enemies to lovers is going quickly. Yeah, Stockholm Syndrome. That feels more right. That feels more right. <laughs> Maybe she's planning to romance him so she can get closer to him and kill him. Have you read the vampire newspaper? It has great circulation, guys. Oh my gosh. The dad jokes. The dad jokes are very strong in this household. Okay, what else do you need to do? Reach Vampire Law 7 and defeat three vampires in combat. Okay, so you probably need to read your vampire tome again. Is it in your inventory? No, it's probably in here. Yeah, read a bit more of your vampire tome. Good boy. Chat loves the dad jokes. I do quite like the dad jokes. Class could change his appearance to try and like him. I, I need to ask her like what she actually likes though, like what stuff she's into. To help me, like, figure out, like, what to change in order to try and get her to like him. Uh, she's sleeping right now, though, so I can't really get anything out of her. Did Maya do a painting for us? Yeah, this is what Maya painted. Technology. <laughs> a little car. Maybe I can sell it, though. This- I, how is it only worth $100? It was literally painted by a ghost. It should be worth way more than that. I actually think she's pretty good at painting. So maybe she can do a nice painting for us. Make us some money. You won't get child support because his mother's dead. Oh. Yeah, I didn't think about that. <laughs> Dragon Tears 4, thank you so much for the bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So cheat it. No, I don't want to cheat. I don't want to cheat it. Riku, you need to go to work. You still need to get your logic to level 10, so can you please play that for the next hour? And... <sighs> you already told me that joke once this week! What is wrong with you? Send me some better jokes, okay? I like the jokes, but you need to improve them. And... Klaus probably wants an easy assignment. And who's calling you? Do you mind if I come over right now? Yeah, that's fine. No one's that hungry, so you should be fine. And it's going to take him so long to get to logic level 10. Like, so long. Crazy. I really need the money. I want to make my blood pool better. I really want to improve my blood pool. It's annoying. Who's Klaus's mum? Klaus's mum was... Nicole. Kill Vladdy Daddy. Would we actually get paid out for that? I don't know if this game has inheritance or not. I don't think it does. I just want the money, 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 money. Money. Who are you sad about missing? Oh, probably your children. Fair. Also, you're quite stinky, so please come in here and have a little shower. Thanks. It does with MC Command. What, you can get inheritance? Really? Why have I not had this switched on? How do I turn on inheritance?
Wow. <gasps> we should start getting loads of money now. Okay, that's awesome. We should start getting loads of money now. Because surely there's a lot of people related to us at this point. This is good news. This is good news. This is very good. I like this a lot. I definitely like this a lot. That person has some weird CC. Nice. Why is he such a franks to this episode? I couldn't figure out why the baseball kept getting larger, then it hit me. Did I make you laugh? He's so funny. I love him. He can stick around just for jokes. That makes me very happy. Okay, we've got a mini workout. Uh, redeemed by Joyce. Jo Joyce? I never know how to say that name. So the, the dad jokes are amazing. Let's do a mini workout. We'll do some lifties. We will do 25 of them. Um, so three, two, one, go. Hana, hold, say. Day, Tasa, Yosu, Ilgo, Yodel, Aho, Yol, Yol Hana, Yol Tol, Yol Se, Yol Day, Yol Tasa, Yol Yosu, Yol Ilgo, Yol Yodel, Yol Aho, Summer, Summer Hana, Summer Tol, Summer Se, Summer Day, Summer Tasa. There we go. Oof, I did chest and tries the other day and I can still feel it. Okay, these guys are done with school. I need to find out what her attractive preferences are. You're always tired, so honestly, it's just gonna annoy me. I'm, I'm so sick of you being tired all the time. Uh, please come downstairs and take a shower, and then we'll try and figure out what the attractive... Oh, no. He's hungry. Do you, have you got garlic in your inventory? She does. She's got garlic in her inventory. But he is hungry, and sometimes you just get so angry that you don't know what to do with yourself. Work it out. Do a mini workout. Um... He is hungry though, and she's the only person he can eat right now. Why'd you always do that? Random Tony. Um, okay. Nice. I've got someone all the way over here. So let's do some nom noms. I honestly need to low key eat all of Kim's family because then she'll inherit. And could you change it to yours and Ali's favorite colors for the lights? Okay. So, Mom, Ali's favorite color is easy. His is, like, here. Like, that kind of blue. And then I am, like, here. So I like more, like, turquoise. And together it looks like an ocean. So that's kind of cute. Um, so there we go. And class, please don't burn too much in the sun. Wait, that's not class. Okay, he's not burning in the sun, so that's good. Death dance, death boogie. No, I need to eat you. Come back here. Don't be refusing to get eaten. Man, there we so go. Right. Just a bit casual eating. I love how he dresses, by the way. I think his clothes are. Oh, where are we off? I think his clothes are so nice. I would like. I'd love it if Ali had these clothes. They look really nice. He is burning just slowly. Okay, I'll get him home after this. And then we can go and bother Kim and find out what her attractive preferences are. <laughs> Just go bother her. Oh, you're really hungry as well. Oh, jeez, it's difficult looking after vampires, you know. It is really difficult looking after vampires. Is there another human? Oh, there's one here. Nice. Naomi, please, can I eat you? There we go. And now poor Kim. Poor Kim, we're like, she's like still kind of sad about the whole family situation and missing them all. And how garbage the food is here and her fun is low. And we're like, Kim, what hair colors you like? Kim, what's, um, no. Uh, Kim, what's your like favorite eye color? Kim, um, what kind of legs do you like? Do you like long legs? Because, um, I got long legs. How do I find out her attractive preferences? It isn't it romantic? Ask about attractive. Oh look, as soon as she as soon as he gets there, she just disappears. She's just like, yeah, bye. <laughs> She's like, oh. Aww. 
Oh, poor you. You're such a some human thing. Oh, well. Anyway. Oh, okay. That's cr that crying's all good. She's like, no, I'm not in the mood to talk about this. And he's like, oh. Okay. Dorna Clyde Zoe. Eh? <laughs> what was that? Well, that could have gone better. It seems like Kim didn't appreciate Klaus asking for her fresh fixes. She won't even tell him because he's so... Oh. Oh, she's okay. She's okay. Raph with his jokes again. Uh, did you not manage to eat someone? Oh, I thought she was dying. I literally thought she was dying, but she's not. She was just burning a bit. I've got a bit more time. Oh, I keep getting this animation error. Sometimes it's fine. Sometimes I get the error, which is why it's kind of like hard to know what's wrong. Oh. There we go. Okay, as soon as you've done each, you need to get home. Because you are thirsty, but just get home after that, okay? Okay, she's still Saj. And he's gone to work. Embarrassed. Because he said something awkward. I, can't, I don't know what she's into. And I don't know how to find out. I don't know how to find out what her attractive preferences are. Like... I don't know how to see what she's into. I don't know how. I just don't know how. Right, did you manage to get home quickly? Go. Go, go, go. She might make it. Oh yeah, she shouldn't be sad about the dying, should she? There you go, run! Run! No! You got so close! You got so close! Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Every episode! Every time! When I sent her out, I swear it wasn't even that sunny. And then it just got more sunny. Like... This one is because of the sadness. I'm gonna get Riku to go and plead. Wait, can you plead for a vampire? Surely you can, right? Oh, <gasps> I can give a death flower! <gasps> Sedna. I can give a death flower, right? Oh, she looks so beautiful in death, though. Look how beautifully dead she is. Riku, I, 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 there goes the series. I'm pretty sure I've got a death flower that I can just offer to Grim. I just need to wait for him to get here. He's kind of busy, like, dealing with this one. But he'll be here soon, I'm sure. Oh, Grim! Because she was thirsty! Even in death, she's a haughty. No, I don't like some resistance. Kim has a death flower. All of them do. We always have a death flower on our person. She, even she's got a death flower literally on her, but like, where is Grim? Oh, here he is. He's, he had a busy day, to be fair. Okay, wait till she gets here. Right. And then give the death flower. This is why we've been growing them. You are my hero. I promise I won't forget that I owe my life to your heroic actions. And he liked the death flower. <gasps> she has been brought back. Okay, question. Question. If she gets brought back. Should she be brought back mortal? What do you guys think? I'm gonna let you guys vote on this. So she's allowed to live again, but she is, because she's been died from the sun, she's no longer immortal, which means she can't be a vampire, right? Should she be human? Yay or nay? Uh, 
uh, yeah, maybe a death is what, like, frees her, you know? And big, uh, big Papa Gubs, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Can we welcome big Papa Gubs to the peaches, please? And thank you so much for subscribing at tier two. Thank you so much for that tier two love. Uh, she can go tell jokes with Ruff, exactly. Like, the whole point of being vampire is that you're meant to be immortal. So, like, if you've died, you're no longer immortal. And so you're no longer a vampire, you know? I feel like Dems is the rules. Um... I feel like that is very much the rules. Um, you don't have to be sad, it's fine. Um, so yeah. Oh, what are you doing in here? Why are you mourning Nicole? Weirdo, you never even met her. Weirdo. Um, something I didn't want. You didn't even witness a death. You need to get your emotions in check, girl, okay? Come up here and practice your magic. 82% yay. Okay. Here it goes then. Um, I am going to do it with... <gasps> oh no, they'll still have Rico. I was going to say they'll have no com uh, adults in the house. But Sim commands, is it? Maintain Sim. No. Um, occult commands. We're going to humanize her. So she came back a human. She came back a human. Violet is now a plain. Uh, Violet is now a plain. No, don't adopt as a caregiver. Don't don't adopt as a caregiver. <laughs> uh, a plain old human. So we get to go make a human form. Human form time. <laughs> and then that's it. That will be the final thing we do today. Especially. You're not a human. Look. We know that. We know that. Okay. So can anyone remember? What Violet looked like before she looked like this. Um, no more of this. No more of these. Teethies are back to normal. No more of this or this. And I guess if she's come back from the dead, she's going to have gray hair. Dems is the rules. I mean, it looks great on her, so that's fine. What color eyes did she have? Pink eyes. Should we put her eye colour back to what it was before? And give her like some cute pretty makeup. She's gonna like look all cute again. <gasps> Wait, she's still got some eye stuff on. Oh no, didn't mean to do that. Oh, actually, it's hit those two off. Yeah, perfect. But she's surely still got the eye. How do I get those eye bloods off her? Maybe I can't. I don't think I can get rid of some of the vampireness because I can't access the level that it's on anymore. She had violet eyes. What, like this? Oh, no. These kinds of eyes. She looks so different with grey hair. It's a pain. I, can't, I don't know where it's on. But I don't think I can remove it. I think it's kind of stuck on her now. But I think that's fine. It's kind of like a, from where she was before, you know? The heart cheeks. Oh my gosh, yes, she did have heart cheeks, didn't she? And then, like, soft lips again. Little pink lips. All it took was dying. I don't know why it took you so long to figure that out. And I'll make her eyebrows, like, match her hair a bit more. Like so. Oh, she looks so much cuter already! Uh, you want to change her hairstyle? What kind of hairstyle? What 
like this. You think it's a face paint? I've taken a face paint off. I've taken it all off. Didn't she have the little strawberry dress? She can pretend it was all a bad dream now. <laughs> she does look so different. I don't mind her having these actually because I think it's like a little bit of a... You know, she can't completely escape her past. So I think that's quite cute. Kayla B, thank you so much for the win at 200 bits. What if Violet turns into a witch to try and avenge all the misery that she's caused? She always had a very guilty conscience. I kind of want her to just run away now. Just like run away and maybe she goes to Solani with Ruff. What do you guys think? She looks so cute though. She does look like a little Tinkerbell with those shoes. Oops, what did I just take off? Oh, nothing. Let's just give her um, a little cute necklace. Ah, she looks so baby. She does need life by the beach. Do you have swimwear? You do have swimwear. You are ready for Solani. So ready for Solani. She still looks so young, but she didn't age after becoming a vampire, did she? Yeah, I think I will put her in Solani and played with Ralph. Oh, Violet! You're leaving us! Uh. The music is fitting. It is very fitting. She's about to be an elder. Oh, is she? I need to unflag her for being immortal. Okay, I will check out her um, flags. The music is such and fitting. There will be a YouTube video today. I'm just waiting for it. And okay, where is she at right now? She... No, she's still a young adult. She's got like a whole adult life ahead of her. She's like in this house like something ain't right. Oh my gosh, look how cute she is. It's been so long since we've like seen this version of Viola. I actually forgot how adorable looking she is. Oh. Oh. She's here. Oh gosh, okay. Perfect time to get you out of the house, my love. You're terrified. Oh my gosh, imagine if she gets killed by a ghost now that she's mortal. Where is she? She's here right when this happened. I don't know where she is. I don't know where she is. That's not her, that's Gid. Oh, okay, I'm just gonna get her out of the house right now. I want to capture her. Yeah, I do want to capture her. So, sim commands. Move sim. Into another household. And she's going to be moving in with... Wait, where is he? Hmm, I need to find her, her son. Or like somebody that he lives with. Oh, temperance! That's who it is, temperance. Oh man. I don't wanna like go to the menu and temperance goes because I've been waiting for temperance to be here for so long. Who else does Raph live with? Oh no. I don't think I'm gonna know who else is in that house. Hmm. I may have to do it from the main menu. But I need to find Temperance first. And I'm gonna remove her flag. So, we're going to MCC flags. And she's got a flag for no age, which I need to remove. 
So clear flux. Clear all flux. Boom. Violet has no flux. I just want to check real quick that Ruff doesn't have any flux either. Ruff has no flux. Okay. And Ruff. Who else do you live with? You live in the Admiral's Wreckage? Ugh, I don't know everyone else in that family though. It was Lilith. Lilith. Okay. It only ever shows one sim from the family, which is super annoying. So maintain sim, move sim into another household. He's not on here. Okay, where is Lilith? I can't even remember what Lilith looks like. They just put one sim from each family. Let me know if you see someone. Yeah, but Alvaro might not be the one that appears on here. Lilith! Do you think this is the right family? What if Lilith's moved out? That's her. Okay. Right, get out of here, babes! Go, go, go! I shouldn't, I shouldn't be able to see you down here anymore. <gasps> you need to get out of here right now. You, you need to leave. You need to go. Run. Because Temperance is here. But I want to capture her. I want to capture her as Klaus. Although right now, we've only got Kim and Riku at home. But Temperance is here. Apparently she's like scary and a chaotic ghost. So we're going to save her for next episode. So I am going to hit a hot pause right now. Alex Wonders, thank you so much for subscribing. Please go welcome Alex Wonders to the Peaches, please. I'm going to check real quickly who is currently streaming so that we can go and do our butts a little raid. However, um, I will be having a video that will come up soon. I'm just waiting on some stuff. I'm really sorry. I really wanted to be able to get it up for you guys before I finish my stream. Um, but I'm still waiting on some bits, so I can't get it up just yet. But let me know who you guys would like to raid. We have got uh, Lil playing Sims 4. We've got Pasta playing Among Us. We've got Nina playing Hearthstone. We've got Bella Lasai playing Sims 4. We've got West uh, Wood Law playing Sims 4. And yeah, they're all the ones I can fit on right now. So go ahead and do a little vote now if you're on YouTube. Thank you so much for joining. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.